So I've got all sorts of spices. I've got some cayenne, some garlic salt. Here, Anthony, I've got onion, dried onion flakes, okay. which I love. And you put them into a, into a pestle and mortar or a rolling pin, it's up to you. Or a coffee grinder. Exactly, and they mm. just grind it up so you make a really nice... Powdery. Powdery uh, sort of coating. Because Cajun is from the southern states of America, like Louisiana and places like that, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. So New Orleans and those sort of places. Like Where they use a lot of rouge, don't they? A lot yes, of they uh, blackened rouge and things exactly. like that. Exactly, and sometimes I think it's a bit too black, some of the yeah, stuff. Yeah, absolutely. But I've got, um, I picked this recipe up and I made a film a few years ago in, in um, Key West, in, in, uh, okay, in Florida. In Florida. Well. It's fantastic. Mm. But the whole point is you, I, I, I need to do one side. Mm. Actually, no, I might do two today and pack that on. So if the fish is slightly damp, all the better because it will stick, stick on. To it. But people overcook swordfish, you mustn't do it. Absolutely. No. I mean, uh, I think Tim finds that he doesn't know how to cook it. So. Exactly. So, what I will do, well, I'm using garlic powder and I'm also using um, you like a, bit garlic. Of, a bit of cumin, a bit of all sorts of stuff. But the whole point is you stick it in the pan and don't move it. Okay. Okay, I've got garlic yeah. mayonnaise. Mm -hmm. I've got parsley, smoked paprika, lime juice in there. So, did you roast the garlic yourself? No, I bought it. Oh, you bought it? Can, a lot okay. of supermarkets like to do it now. They do flavour mayonnaise. Mm. That's so right. Flavour tartar sauces as well. And I just want a really astringent. Um, uh, yogurt dressing on top. Now, what so I want the herbs in there. Just parsley. Just parsley. Just parsley. And I will add a little touch of sugar to that as well because I want to okay. take the heat out of the jalapenos. Yep. And I know Tim doesn't like the jalapenos too much. So well, just, he said he didn't mind, but he didn't want to go up to the uh, bars or tandoori level. Exactly, yeah. yeah. So um, I'm going to be quite careful on that. Look, what I'm going to do on the lettuce, again to cut the, the, the richness there, so I'm going to put a little bit of yeah. oil. You can see why they call it blackened. I mean, it's yeah. not burnt at all, but it's got a lovely colour, lovely crust on the top of that sauce. Exactly. And as you can still see, Anthony, it's, yeah. still, it's still raw. Like, yeah, it's nice. But right. it's off the heat. The swordfish, a bit like tuna, it does not like to be well cooked, does it? No, it doesn't. It's mm. like tuna, I mean, it goes to mush really yeah, very quickly. Right. Now here, what I'm going to do is put a little bit of vinegar and oil on the lettuce okay. to start breaking so it, it down. Nice. Yeah.